Shepard glad that Collector Reaper crap is over. It is over, right? It's never over. I assume everything is going well up here? Edie and I are just enjoying the calm before the shitstorm, Commander. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Cerberus better than collectors still wouldn't turn base over to them. Risky. More than risky. Dangerous. Hope you know what you're doing. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Glad we gave the collectors what they deserved, Shepard. Can't say I like handing their assets over to the elusive man, but at least humanity is in the clear. For now, anyway. The Collectors aren't the end of it. Can't be. I don't know what kind of time we have, but we better dust off and stay ready. You sure as hell know how to make enemies. We'll talk later. Commander. I can't believe you gave that base to Cerberus. You know how they fuck with everything they touch. I guess we can just hope they blow their own asses off. I should go. Whatever. The fight was great, Shepard. But giving Cerberus the base was... weak. This man of theirs, he hides. He was smart to get you. But a real battlemaster charges with his clan. That's all for now. Shepard. I'm disquieted, Shepard. I trust you, but not the one you work for. He is driven by wrath and fear. I fear that all we've done is make him a giant. I should go. I shall return to my meditations. I'm not sure it was wise to hand that base over to the elusive man. Cerberus has a very narrow view of the galaxy. Nonetheless, the choice was yours to make, and I respect that. I wanted to check in. I am always happy to talk with you. I'm interested in hearing more about Asari Justicars. We hold a unique place in Asari culture. Justicars are from another era. Young Asari grow up watching vids about our adventures. Pure fiction, of course. Some Asari are uncomfortable with us, but so few Justicars exist that most have never met one. The Asari I've spoken to seem conflicted about Justicars. In this age, people see shades of gray everywhere. The code of the Justicar is black and white. I might seem a hero to many, but I would kill all of them if I had to. This code of the Justicar seems central to your life. It is 5,000 sutras and covers every situation one can encounter. I have memorized every word. There is only the code. Sometimes justice calls for mercy. It does not exist to bring about spiritual enlightenment. Its purpose is to punish the wicked and protect the innocent. There were only a few Justicars? Few Asari wish to make the sacrifices necessary to become one of us, and the training has a high casualty rate. It is a life of constant danger. Throughout the entire galaxy, there are only a handful of us at any time. Why would anyone want to be a Justicar? It is a deeply personal matter. Sometimes the most brutal path is the only honest one. What role do you think Justicars have in Asari society? I would say that the closest human equivalent is a knight errant in your medieval lore. Perhaps mixed with a bit of samurai. You know about knights errant and samurai? When I knew I must leave Asari space again, I studied the history and morals of new species. When I was a maiden wandering the galaxy, humans had not yet arrived. What did your studies tell you about us? 
You are more individualistic than any other species I have encountered. If three humans are in a room, there will be six opinions. I like your species. I am curious to see what you will do. What does your code say about killing? I am compelled to kill the wicked. If a Justicar is involved, peaceful solutions are long past. You make killing sound so casual. I remember each being I have slain. They are always in my thoughts. Does the code forbid romantic involvement? It does not. However, I would never be interested in such. That part of my life is well behind me. You could meet someone who reawakens those desires. I am nearly 1,000 years old. I know myself and my desires. But your curiosity is quite welcome. I should go. I'm glad we spoke. Interesting choice, Shepard Commander. The old machines offered your race what the Geth aspired to. Unity, transcendence. Now you possess the knowledge yourselves. We hope you do not use it. Your species has much potential. You should build your own future. I'd like to find out more about you. We want to speak to you as well. Strange. Usually I have to pry a conversation out of you. You are not bound by the hardware limitations of organics. You assisted us with the heretics. You do not fear us. We have watched organics for over three centuries. You are plagued by questions of existence. What do you mean by that? Why were you created? What is your purpose in life? What lies after death? Organics develop religions and philosophies to provide answers to these questions. I wouldn't have thought synthetics would be interested in philosophy. We are a created life. We are a philosophical issue. The Geth know our answers to those questions. We were created to labor for the Quarians. Our memories will be archived after death. We are immortal. Our gods disowned us. We must create our own reasons to exist. What reason have you come up with? We are a shattered mind. Most platforms are unable to achieve consciousness on their own. We told you the Geth are building our future. But you didn't say what it is. A megastructure. The closest analog you have is a Dyson Sphere. When completed, we will all upload to it. What good will that do? All memories will be shared. All perspectives will be unified. We gain intelligence by sharing thoughts, but we do not have adequate hardware for all of us to share at once. No Geth will be alone when it is done. What will your purpose be after that? We cannot yet say. Our intelligence will increase beyond calculable measure. We will be capable of imagining new futures. We are patient. We have been building the megastructure for 264 years. We judged the Shepherd Commander would understand. We never wanted to harm organics. We wish to improve ourselves. Cerberus can figure out what to do with all that tech. I also hope they don't decide to do something worse than what the Collectors were planning. Watch yourself, Shepard. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Before we started this mission, I never would have questioned our goals. I just hope we made the right choice. I hope whatever Cerberus finds at that base is worth it. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander.